Hi everyone, this is the 155th video of the ACT math practice problem series and here we have another interesting problem from trigonometry. As I always recommend, before seeing the solution, you can pause the video and give it a try yourself and after that of course you want to match with my solution. So let's get started. Here the question says, tangent of 1 degree times tangent of 2 degree times tangent of 3 degree times all the way up to tangent of 88 degree times tangent of 89 degree is equal to which of the following five options. So this is a product of total 89 factors and we have to find out the value of this product. Now in this problem there is a pattern that we can see that the value of angle in the first tangent ratio which is 1 degree and the value of the angle in the last tangent ratio which is 89 degree the sum of these two angles is actually 90 degree. As you can see here 1 degree and 89 degree their sum is 90 degree. Similarly if you look at 2 degree and 88 degree degree their sum is also 90 degree. So there is probably something we can do about this entire product and convert it into nice pairs like this and that might help us simplify the situation. And actually what we have to do, we have to use the concept of trigonometric ratio of complementary angles. Because if you think about it, 1 degree is a complementary angle of 89 degree or 89 degree is a complementary angle of 1 degree, you can think of it that way also. So these are the pairs of complementary angles and let's see what we can do about them. As you already know, tangent of 90 degree minus theta is equal to cotangent of theta. Similarly, if we say tangent of 1 degree which can be written as tangent of 90 degree minus 89 degree and that can be written as cotangent of 89 degree. So the tangent of 1 degree right here this can be written as cotangent of 89 degree. Now think about the first factor and the last factor and let's try to multiply them together and see what happens. So the first factor now looking like cotangent of 89 degree times the last factor is tangent of 89 degree and can we write it as 1 over tangent of 89 degree the first factor here times tangent of 89 degree and that is equal to 1. So you can clearly see that we can create pairs of the factors which are eventually going to become 1. So now if you think about it we can create pairs like this. Now we already saw the first pair which is tangent of 1 degree times the last one tangent of 89 degree this is equal to 1. Similarly we can create another pair tangent of 2 degree times tangent of 80 8 degree that will also become 1 and similarly if we keep on doing like this we will create another factor let's say tangent of 3 degree times tangent of 87 degree that will also become 1 and similarly if we keep on doing like this we will end up with a factor like this tangent of 44 degree times tangent of 46 degree that will also become 1 and then the only other factor which is remaining is tangent of 45 degree. Since we have odd number of factors in this product we have been able to create 44 pairs like this and this is the only odd man out here he does not have a pair but not a problem this guy is also equal to 1. So now if you think about it we have been able to create 44 pairs and this one factor whose value is also 1 one and if you take their product obviously it will be 1. So 1 times 1 times 1 times 1 44 such pairs right multiplied by tangent of 45 degree and that is also equal to 1 we know that right. So ultimately the value of this product is looking like 1 and that is our answer and if you look at our answer options we have 1 under option C. So option C should be the correct option. I hope everything made sense. Thank you for watching. See you in the next video.